Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Willie V, aka Boo Boy Counts. Just have a quick tip here for you. It's just a follow up to my previous uh, tutorial on letterboxing your videos using QuickTime Pro. As I did mention, uh, Stop will do the same thing. iMovie, there is a simple workaround for that. But in ScreenFlow, it's, it's a bit different. So I want to show this for those that do use ScreenFlow. So normally when you're using ScreenFlow, you'll click on File, Export, and you know, you're probably thinking it's theoretically the same as um, QuickTime Pro, and you'll pick your size, and then you'll go into the uh, motion here of you know trying to to select your your size. So we'll do 640 by 480. We'll select that, and then we'll check off preserve aspect ratio. Now, the one thing uh, you want to keep in mind with ScreenFlow is that ScreenFlow ignores the interface that is used for QuickTime. So basically, it's, it considers this the QuickTime interface. So when you go to Letterbox, it it just ignores it so you don't want to do it through here the way you want to do your letterboxing is through the um, first menu when you first get your uh, size now by default it always scales it down to 50 percent so in my case 960 by 600 now if I leave it at 960 by 600 and I select letterbox because it's already at the default size for 50%. When it exports the movie, it's not letterboxed. It's still 960 by 600. So what you want to do is you actually want to input the dimensions. So in our case, uh, what did I say? 640. Uh, I forgot what it was. 640 by 400 or 400 and something. But anyway, we'll just say this for example. Um, you want to you want to use a size that's a letterbox format, and then go ahead and export your video. And then by doing that, then it will make your um, ScreenFlow movie a letterbox format, which then you can go ahead and directly upload to YouTube. Anyway, I just want to point that out real quick. So if anybody had a question about that then you understand how that is uh, done. All right, as always, this is Willie V, a.k.a. Boo Boy Kennels, and thank you for taking the time to watch.